win in a big third period against the Pittsburgh Penguins. Um, how does something like this happen to get a start like you had and then to have a game like you had here in New Jersey? Yeah, well, it, it, all, easy, Paul. It's uh, very disappointing, uh, very disappointing. Um, how it happened is, you know, you, you, you put in front a simple, simple game plan, pucks behind, pucks to the net. Obviously, that didn't happen. Um, Self-inflicted uh, wounds right away for, for three, three goals we Two goals, really. We, 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 we have a struggling period there, and we, we struggle to keep it simple just the last five minutes and get out of the period 2-0. Uh, and, and the third goal was just a really uh, t- turnover neutral ice. Uh, and it's in the back of our net. It's 3-0, and we turn over on entry. A couple minutes later, it's 4 nothing at the end of the one. So um, inability to keep it simple. Um, again, on. Didn't put enough pucks behind, obviously. Didn't put a pucks, enough pucks to the net, obviously. Uh, and those are, we just didn't work hard enough. And, and those are real, real, real indicators uh, of such. Why is that a trend with the group? I mean, slow starts have been an issue since the start of the season. Um, what do you make of that? Well, Lance, I would say I, I make of it. I'm not happy about it, obviously. Um, it's, uh, it's something, you know, the, the lessons will keep repeating till you learn them. And you, you you come off a, a game you feel you feel good about it last night, um, but you have to have greater respect going in uh, to the intensity that's needed day, day in and day out in this league, uh, and the, the the good habits and things that would wear on on your opponent rather than wear on you. And uh, it's it's a matter of respect for that. It's a matter of experience gained in that and lessons learned. And um, it's a big lesson, obviously, uh, tonight. I know you mentioned the lessons, but a lot of the guys who made mistakes in that first period are experienced NHL guys. So when it comes to addressing an ongoing issue like that, is it what do you do? Because you're a quarter of the way through the season and you can't fall behind this many times in games, especially in the first period. Well, you can't fall behind if you can't come back, Lance. That's absolutely 100% true. Um, but, you know, you, you push, you demand. This, this is... This is part of part of growing. It's part of uh, becoming better. There's teams through the league that, you know, when goals are given up in the league, this is how they're given up. Very, very few goals are scored just talent, you know, uh, just on sheer talent. It's it's breakdowns, goal after goal after goal, and we had too many breakdowns tonight. And you know, again, it's it's that's how goals are scored in the NHL. We we had too many breakdowns, and um, again, you you. Who knows? You play last night. You get on a plane. You come in late. You gotta, if if you are tired, you gotta learn how to deal with it. You gotta find a B game. You gotta, you gotta, uh, you know, you make errors. It's, you make errors late in a shift because you're tired. uh, Anywhere in the league, I'm not talking even about tonight, you know. So, but you have to learn how to play that way and uh, and and be smarter. And we weren't. We just weren't. So. You sense the group is sort of struggling to manage the. I mean, higher expectations, pressure. I mean, this this isn't uh, really a development group anymore. I mean, the expectation is that you guys take that next step this year. I think that's a that's an absolute component, and that's a good component. It's it's pushing us to learn more, and it's you you can't get that until you get to this this moment to to this pressure, this expectation. But I but I do think that's a factor. Look at the the team we played and the expectation that's on them, and the, I, I don't. You know, they came in the game with same struggles. These are struggles that every team has, and you have to solve and resolve. And, and uh, you know, so for us, the good of it is uh, that we're in a position that that is the case. You do feel you do feel that uh, necessity and need to an urgency is, is probably the best way to put it, urgency, and you've got to deal with that urgency. And uh, it can't cloud the focus on what needs to be executed, and I feel it did tonight. You spoke about being demanding. Do you need to demand more from them, or do they need to demand more from themselves? Uh, you know, the demand has been there, and and you know, like Lance said, the demand of expectation is pressure. Uh, we we demand more. You guys know that as as coaches. And when you do that, there's there's more pressure, and it can get compo- it can compound things that you then have to learn how to deal with them. And we're in the process of that. Uh, uh, dealing with greater pressures and greater demand. Um, you know, I don't know what more demand you can put on them than the team across the rink just put on them and you, and you didn't do it. So uh, you, you, you pick up the pieces and you, you, you do your best to uh, soak up the experience and learn from it. Um, but that's, that's playing in the, 
playing in the National Hockey League.